Did you know that one out of three people have a chronic condition? That could be anything like allergy, asthma, diabetes, autoimmune disease. One out of three means that it's either you or the person to your right or to your left. I know something about it. I grew up with several allergies, eczema, asthma. That means that on a, on a nice spring day, I cannot enjoy that because I'm allergic to pollen. I could be killed by a bee because I'm allergic to bees. And maybe the worst part is that I'm an Italian who cannot eat gluten. But the worst part about chronic diseases is that they're very expensive because they cannot be cured. The UN says that they will cost $47 trillion in 2030. That's a lot. It's roughly half of the world's GDP. It's clearly unfeasible. Imagine if we were able to save that money and also to make those one out of three people live a healthy and free life. Imagine if we could prevent chronic diseases altogether. Well, science shows us that the answer might be in our gut microbiome, and especially in the first years of life. The gut microbiome is the collection of microbes in our gut, and in particular, childhood is important. So when a baby is born, it seems that their gut is colonized and populated by bacteria and microbes, and although that seems very nasty, it's actually a good thing. We need microbes to be healthy. We need them, and without them, we would be ill. But not all kinds of microbes. We need the right combination at the right time and in the right order. So studies show that some gut microbiome patterns are associated to good lifelong health, while other patterns are associated to chronic diseases later in life. So the path to disease could be already determined in the first years of life. And that's not some new science. There's more than 10,000 publications on this, and in the first couple of years, we've had an exponential growth of studies and, and uh, publications on this topic. But the gut microbiome is also linked to very common symptoms in children, like colic, sleep disruption, eczema, and those are the symptoms that make babies cry a lot. That's one of the biggest uh, concerns for parents, and that's something that keeps millions of parents and babies up at night. Despite all of this knowledge and the fact that we know all of this, not much innovation has happened in this space for decades. At Alba Health, we're a group of scientists, parents, and people who know the struggles of living with a chronic condition, and we want to change that. We envision a future where we use this knowledge, and that's possible by using machine learning and metagenomics, which is the study of microbial DNA. We want a future where we can detect these gut imbalances that are linked to disease, restore them, because changing the gut microbiome is possible through diet and probiotics, and track the gut microbiome development over time for life, making sure that that development is optimal. Alba Health is gut health support for children zero to four years old, and it's very simple. As a parent, you get a kit that allows you to take a sample, which is a stool sample from the baby's diaper. It takes only one minute, um, it goes right to your home, it's not invasive, and you get back results and recommendations along diet, probiotics, and lifestyle. You then track progress and see if that works and if that changed the gut microbiome, and you can track that over time and track that the development is optimal. Today, we focus on general well-being and in particular on crying and sleep, so imagine for some babies uh, that experience these symptoms and have already been to the doctor, this is a way to go deeper and into the root cause of these symptoms. In the future, our ambition is really to make the link with chronic conditions, and in particular, eczema and allergy. 
we are the first company in this field and the only company in this field that has made a research collaboration with, what, with one of the biggest studies in the world in this field. And that is with the Helmi cohort from the University of Helsinki. This study has followed 1,000 babies for six years and has over 10,000 gut microbiome samples from birth, each of them linked uh, to a deep questionnaire on lifestyle and on health outcomes. So we know the path of the gut microbiome and the health outcomes later in life. That adds to the fact that our co-founder has more than 800 publications on this topic, and our scientific advisory board has over 1,600 publications on this. So Alba empowers families to change um, their children's gut microbiome and get a better lifestyle when it matters the most. And that's done in a simple, affordable, and now for the first time in an evidence-based and data-driven way. But that's not all. Um, everyone that joins Alba also joins a bigger mission. And we're, together, we're collecting anonymized data to advance chronic disease prevention. So if you like our mission and you want to help us, I have a very specific request for you. We launched, uh, just two days ago, the biggest study um, in this field connecting the gut microbiome and crying in Sweden. We did that with several universities in Sweden, Denmark, Belgium. We were looking for 150 families to join us, and we found them in 24 hours, which is fantastic. But we're now expanding our study. So if you're a parent with a child zero to one year old, go to our website, helpalbahealth.com, join our study, or help us spread the word. And otherwise, connect with us on LinkedIn, on social media. You can find us at Alba Health. Thanks so much.